Hey guys, um, sorry I haven't made a video in a while. I've been busy doing some other stuff, but I'm finally getting around to one. And, um, yeah, so today I'm going to be showing you how to change the icon for USBs. I don't know about you guys, but I think it's a little boring. That little icon that comes up, the, um, um, oh, not control panel. Um, computer. Where are we? This one. It's this little USB drive. I mean, it's okay sometimes, but it just looks a little boring. So I'm going to show you guys how to change it to whatever you want. Um, right. So first of all, you just want to get any image. I got this one off Google Images. It's just going crossbone. It's kind of cool, and um, then you want a sort of image editing program. I've got XN View. I'll show you guys. Um, so you just want to get the image, and then save as, and then a Windows icon file. And once you've done that, sometimes it might make the Windows icon and it might still have white in the background or something like that it might screw up so you want to get an image that will nicely once you've converted it from whatever one this was a png image until it changes to the ico uh, windows icon you'll notice that in this one the um, image has white background whereas in this one it's just the actual black outline that's the Windows icon and how it's transparent through the middle it doesn't have this white stuff so um, once you've got your little image that you want to use for your uh, USB icon you want to open up your USB so come in here actually I'll put that to the side and sorry guys my USB is a little messy it's got a lot of stuff but um, basically what we're going to be doing is making an auto run file and if you don't know what that is it's basically a file that you can put settings data for removable disks <coughs> excuse me like um, CDs, DVDs and USBs and stuff like that so um, first of all you can either like you just open up a new notepad window and just type in fact no I'll do this first right so basically with the icon for the USB it will I can't get it to mine doesn't like doing the icon as anything other than dot exe so you can make the icon of your USB um, the icon of any program so basically once we've got this little image here you want to change the file format from .ico to .exe so go to properties and then under general it will be .ico and so just want to change that to .exe do you want to change yes and so basically what's that, what that's done is it makes Windows think that it's a program and even if you run it or try to run it nothing will happen and so it's a harmless thing that won't do anything it's just made Windows think it's a program and what that will do is it will allow us to put that icon as our USB icon so um oh yeah and your computer might not be able to change the uh, the file extension um, Windows doesn't default allow you to do that so if you've watched my iPhone ringtone tutorial, you'll know how to do this. But just go to Control Panel, Appearance and Personalization, Folder Options, and then under the View tab, scroll down a bit, and it is Hide Extensions for Known File Types. Just want to uncheck that, untick that, and then OK, and out of there. And so once we've got the .exe file the um, icon one 
you just want to drag that into your USB so copy to my USB and you'll see that it's in there so now we want to create the auto run file which will put that icon as our USB icon so basically I'll just minimize that open up new notepad window and what you want to type is this auto run um, you always type that at the beginning of of any auto run file and then all we need to type here is icon equals pick.exe and then just want to save it and we can save it to our USB and what we want to do here is we want to sorry MSN we want to change the type to all files and we want to save it as auto run dot inf and so save that to your USB and so I'll just check that it made it in here um, auto run dot inf and you notice that it's setup information that's what it will say so I'm um, click out of that and dun, 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 dun. come on eject the USB and I'll pull it out and put it back in and hopefully I'm hoping this works there you go you'll notice that it has this icon as the USB icon now and when you go into computer you'll see here my USB has the skull and crossbones as my icon and one other thing you can do if you've got a program that you like to use that's on your USB all the time you can actually make it so that when it opens auto run um, where are we? open auto play so in the auto run when it comes up here when you first plug it in it can come up with a thing in here that says open my program um, I'll sh show that in another t in a later tutorial in my next one um, but yeah that's the tutorial on how to change the icon for your USB I hope you enjoyed it um, and thanks for watching.